Hello, Michael Mazarang here again, and I'm here with Billy Mitchell. Uh, he is the owner of Intellivent, and we wanted to continue on with our uh, series on encapsulation versus ventilation. Uh, and in specific today, we wanted to talk about dehumidifiers. Uh, there is a common misconception in the industry that uh, dehumidifiers are a great device to reduce qual space moisture and it couldn't be farther from the truth. Um, the industry is filled with franchisees and companies that uh, promote that close, seal up the vents, throw out the expensive pool liner and put in the $2,000 dehumidifier to reduce just a few pints of moisture that accumulate in your crawl space. Uh, dehumidifiers uh, are not designed to operate efficiently in uh, in crawl spaces. They're basically air conditioning units. Uh, but Billy, tell me a little bit about your experience with dehumidifiers and why somebody watching today may want to think twice about uh, using a dehumidifier as the sole source of moisture reduction in their crawl space. Yeah, and that's the key, Mike, using the dehumidifier as a sole source of moisture reduction. Uh, in, in concert with other systems, uh, they, they can be beneficial uh, and, and say after a, uh, some type of restoration of fire or flood, uh, oftentimes you need one, but um, you don't want a dehumidifier running all the time in your crawl space. And if you just uh, seal off your vents and put a dehumidifier in there, that's exactly what will happen. Uh, crawl space rated dehumidifiers, 500 to 700 watts. We've seen them up to 1200 watts. Uh, you can imagine what that would do to your energy bill. Uh, plus, they only really do a good job of, of conditioning or drying the air in about a 15-foot radius around the unit. Um, you still have all that other crawl space that's not being affected by the unit. Um, you'll have opportunities for stale pockets of air or moist pockets of air to build up in the corners. Uh, and you don't have good air movement or cross flow. Um, and so the dehumidifier is not, in that case, able to uh, benefit the entire crawl space. So. Uh, they, they're, they're energy hogs, they can be very inefficient, and then on the front end, they're just so expensive. I, I would definitely recommend looking into the possibility of some other type of, of solution, um, particularly the, the, the controlled ventilation system that takes advantage of fresh air, uh, fresh dry air, does the exact same thing that a dehumidifier does, but does it with, a, with substantially less energy and at uh, a comparable cost, really. That's right. Um... You know, Billy and I are independent uh, moisture control specialists in Charlotte. Uh, you know, we've got 20 years experience between each one of us uh, uh, you know, doing crawl space uh, science type solutions on houses. Uh, and we'd love to share with you the valid information about alternative sources of moisture control for your crawl space. Um, you know, We've been trained, you know, I've worked at an engineering firm, you know, Billy's worked at you know, uh, uh, several companies and then now has his own company. Uh, you know, it, you want to deal with somebody that actually has real understanding of the science on why the moisture problem happens. And that's, uh, that should be the important thing that you want to consider as you make your decision. We want to give you all of the information so that you can make an educated decision on on your choice of of, of potential programs inside the crawl space um, and we, we definitely want to talk to you um, if you want to learn more about dehumidifiers and the fallacies behind dehumidifiers uh, you know give us a call you know you, you can call me at 704-787-6972 my name is Michael Mazarang or you can call Billy directly uh, his number is 704-701-3710. And yeah, we'd love to talk to you and you know, we'll be glad to set an appointment to come to your home. We can consult by phone and educate you on the, uh, on the dew point technology, which uses low voltage technology and often eliminates the need for an expensive dehumidifier. But uh, uh, we appreciate you visiting with us today and we look forward to talking to you more about crawl space science. Uh, and we hope you have a good rest of the day. Thank you very much.